can't believe we did all that in one video. Shit. I mean, not shit. That's actually pretty awesome. from here. Okay, well, we're not just... Okay, we're just gonna get on the ground and do it. Shit. Let's go over those ones I couldn't find again. Alright, we gotta get the Batmobile positioned. And do it from here. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, that was easy enough, huh? Come on, bats, get up there. Be away in there somewhere. This is a city we can be terrorizing. No one else. There is no discernible way in there. Go this way. That freaking bat tank fires non lethal rounds. It's like getting punched by an angry gorilla.
No, I just remember my dad's middle name was Wayne. Wow. I really never noticed that. Solve this. How do we solve this? It has to do with this thing. Okay, don't push the R button. Okay, it's the circle button that does that. The little explosion that we never use for anything else. We gotta get above that. Cause like that. Cause like when I uh, ejected up there, that berry didn't hurt me. Even though it looks electrified, it actually didn't hurt me. That time just didn't respond. about this. Lock on. Yeah. 
Whistle gel. Wow, this is some puzzle. Like, it totally looks like you have to be up there, but it won't allow you up there. Explosives deployed around the city. Time to hunt them down. But the battering can be up here. But they don't stay off. This is really mind boggling. do here screw this place Target the same one. Yes. Maybe there's some kind of upgrade I need to get. You know, yeah, it seems like this is something that I would need, but that's not the case.
respawn as always. Whoops. I'm a stupid fat man. I'm not gonna grab onto that even though I horribly registered when I grabbed onto the freaking roof of the floating car and I didn't want you to. Blockade. Oh, you know what? I think I know what this is about. Wait a minute. Get off! Oh, I don't know what it's about. Well, he's got a big car up here now. Like, I thought, thought that involved, like, a forensics challenge and we would, um... You know, had to blow the clock open. But there is a forensics challenge right there! We can bring the car up here. But we have to go through some kind of puzzle to bring the car up here. Just angle this. Beautiful. Open. 
Well, since I'm here, might as well save Robin's ass. Hey, what's I'm scared? What's too small? What's out of you? Oh, these are the dead guys. Giving up the cowl, eh, Batsy? Good for you. You save your friends. I give another token of talk. <laughs> Hang on. What a fat face kills you once he's had his fun. I changed my mind. We don't have to go. Caring for friends is overrated, especially yours. They can't be left alone for five minutes without being kidnapped. I guess this is when you would have um, noticed the Riddler trophies. You can look here. He wasn't safe. And he is now. He'd take a bullet for you, Bruce. We all would. But you left him. Defenseless. You didn't even give him a choice. I'm sorry, Bruce, but you have to get him back. Whatever it takes. Yeah. So it's decision. So I'm not preoccupied. Give yourself up to Scarecrow and get us both killed? Or is it time for the new dynamic duo to hit the streets? <laughs> yes, I knew it could do Asriel. GCPD choppers have reported a burning bat symbol atop the Lady of Gotham. Asriel's ready. Oh wow, this is a nice place to do it.
Oh, it's up there. That's the pretty cool place to do it. I am ready to face your final challenge. It's the toughest yet. Uh oh. Yeah, I'm not really good at these guys. Only a worthy successor can complete the challenge and avoid getting hit. Yeah, you get hit hundreds of times. Better than this. Forgive me. Don't lose concentration. Keep an eye out for them better. I have no one to blame but myself. Stay focused. Israel. You have passed the test. I will contact you when I have made my decision. There is no decision to make, Batman. I am ready now. I decide how this works, not you. Every moment you waste, Gotham falls deeper into the abyss. Make your decision fast, or she will be lost forever. Sir, we have a positive ID on Azrael. His real name is Michael Lane. Lame. He was a GCPD officer before he was dismissed due to psychological issues. And then, well, he seems to have disappeared off the face of the earth. That must have been when he was recruited by the Order of Saint Dumas. It gets decidedly more peculiar, sir. The bad computer has picked up an irregularity in Lane's physiology. I've not seen anything like this before. Upload the data to the clock tower. I can analyze it from there. Right, you are, sir. Do you see the credits yet? Not yet. <laughs> There's something unusual about Azriel's neurological activity. I'm heading to the clock tower to analyze it on the bat computer. Perhaps it's a sign of disease, sir. Or something worse. Yeah. Alright, next time we'll learn about Ezreal.